Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. And for this video, we're going to unbox this package I got from Lazada a while ago. Most probably, guys, you know what's inside. Well, because of the title and the thumbnail. <laughs> so without any more further ado, guys, let's go and check out what's inside this box. But before anything else, I'm Luis, the Dimple the Engineer, and of course, with my dog, Olaf the Maltese. And this is our YouTube channel. our Lazada package and let's start unpacking. Nicely bubble wrapped. So okay guys, here it is. It's the TP-Link UH720 USB 3.0 7 port hub. Actually, it also includes an additional two port smart charger so guys just a little background uh, I bought this because my desktop PC's front USB panel is already acting up so most of the time it does not read my my thumb drive or any external external hard drives and um, if you if you watched my last video regarding my my review of the Edifier K800 USB Type uh, headset, so I plugged that uh, USB headset uh, via my desktop PC's front USB panel, and it produced or recorded a lot of unnecessary noise, unwanted noise. Um, I think it's heezing sound or high pitch sound. So there, I decided to get this USB 3.0 uh, USB hub uh, because also my desktop PC is only a basic desktop PC so it only has four uh, USB slots uh, at the back. So those four are already used by my keyboard, my mouse, my webcam for my online classes and of course the the USB type headset so when I want to plug an external drive or additional webcam I will not be able to do it because as I've said my front USB ports the, the, the desktop PC's front USB ports are already acting up so uh, I bought this uh, from Lazada uh, it's around 1,800 pesos and I already checked this out in the local computer stores. It's, I think the retail price of this is around 2,100 pesos. So I saved um, a little over 300 pesos. So kudos to Lazada. Thank you for, for the sale. So okay guys, let's proceed with the unboxing. Okay guys, uh, the box contains, of course, the main unit. Mm. Okay. It's very lightweight and thin. I was expecting a thicker, thicker device. So... In front, guys, are the seven USB 3.0 ports. And here on the right side are the USB charging ports. 
we will going to test this with my S21 if it will trigger the fast charging on the left side none so at the back guys here's the USB micro B for connecting this to your computers or laptops and this is the power port so nothing at the bottom so user guide the a big power brick The, the USB Type A to USB Micro B cable. So, okay, guys, we're done with the unboxing. So, what we're going to do next is we will quickly test the performance of this TP Link UH727 port USB hub. So, we're going to transfer files from my laptop going to my external hard drive so this is a WD 3.0 USB 3.0 external drive so we're going to use my trusty uh, audio quest uh, USB USB cable and also guys we're going to test the fast charging ports if it will trigger the fast charging capabilities of my S21 okay Let's go. So, but before we proceed, guys, I would just like you to meet my dog, the other dog, Lit Lit. Hi. So, she's a mixed breed of Yorkshire Terrier and my mini Schnauzer. Say hi to them. So, okay, guys, for this initial test, I connected my um, WD external hard drive directly to my laptop and we will transfer this video file this 814 MB um, from my laptop to my external hard drive copy and we will paste it here on the root root folder or root directory let's see the speed So average speed is around 33 to 34 Mbps. So okay guys, let's try another one. This video file here. And we will paste it again in the root directory of my Internal drive. Let's check out the speed. Average speed is still at 33 to 34 Mbps. Okay, guys, let's now transfer. To the TP-Link UH720 powered USB hub. So, okay guys, for our next test, we're going to use the TP-Link UH720 USB hub. I connected it uh, to the same USB port and connected it to a power source. And actually guys on top is a power button there and now we're going to plug my external drive to this uh, TP-Link USB hub Ok 
Okay, it already detected my, my external hard drive. And now, we're going to test the same video file. So, here it is. Ah, sorry. Copy. Then, we're going to paste it here. On the root folder. Paste. Replace the file. And the average speed is around 30 to 32 Mbps. So not bad guys. Almost. So almost no speed degradation. Only, I think, one Mbps. So let's try another one. So this one, the 800 for 34 MB. Copy, and we're going to paste it here on my external drive's root directory. So okay guys, there you have it. Speed this there around 30 to 32 Mbps. Not sh not much of a difference compared to the compared when directly plugging this external hard drive to the laptop. So for our next test guys, we're going to test the this, the fast charger ports. If it will trigger the fast charging capabilities of my S21. So okay guys, here is my S21. And we are going to connect it to this fast charging port. Let's see. Okay, it's fully plugged in. And let's check out the status of my charging. only cable charging not triggering the fast charging capabilities of my S21 but nonetheless it charges my phone I'll take it so okay guys I already connected the TP link to my main desktop and we're going to try uh, what's the speed so I also connected the Internal hard drive to this TP link. So we're going to try and see what's the speed. Okay. So we're going to transfer this movie file, a 2.7 gigabytes movie, to copy, and then we will transfer it to my external hard drive the speed so for my desktop PC the average speed using the tip link is around 35 megabytes per second So okay guys, that's it. That's our quick unboxing and quick test of this TP-Link 
UH-720 7-port powered USB hub with additional two ports of um, USB charging. So guys, if you're planning in expanding your USB ports for your laptops or your desktop PCs, I think this TP-Link USB hub is a very good, uh, very good choice because, guys, uh, as per our speed test, it, uh, it's I think 98% does not degrade the speed uh, of the transfer speed of your laptops or desktop PCs. So okay guys, before I end this video, I would just like to thank every one of you guys for watching this video and continuously supporting my channel. And if you're not yet my subscriber, I would really appreciate it guys to please subscribe and click the like button because it really helps my channel to grow so I would be able to make more videos like this and if it's not too much to ask kindly also hit the notification bell so you will be the first one to know guys whenever I upload videos and once again guys thank you for watching I'm Luis the dimpled engineer and of course with my dogs see you on our next video guys always stay safe and god bless